Hello, and welcome back to my channel. It was brought to my attention that not everybody knows how to do this, and to be fair, um, neither do I. I was taught how to use uh, my barbecue by my husband, and let me tell you, it was painful. I didn't want to be mansplained to. I didn't want to be, uh, you know, have someone standing over me uh, watching me grill. I just wanted to be like, press this button and go. So um, he didn't do that, but I'm gonna I'm gonna do that for you, okay? Because that's why you've come here, probably, maybe, apparently. So we're working with a gas barbecue today, and I'm gonna show it to you, but it's real dirty. Cause like, that's his job, man. If you're not sure what you're working with, um, propane is probably a tank. Can't help you with that. I assume it's similar to the natural gas that I'm working with, but who knows? Don't blow shit up, okay? Like, play safe. Um, charcoal, don't have a clue. Something about building a TP or a, uh, is it like making a bonfire? I can't do that either. So, I can't help you. But here we go, we're gonna do this. We got this little, ow, oh my. We got this little doohickey here. We gotta flip that up. That's what actually uh, opens up the gas line, probably. That's maybe what it does. And then we've got these little knobbies. We're gonna turn them to just like on and be hot. Oh yeah, you hear that sound. And then I'm opening it just to show you. It's like relatively clean on the inside, but like that outside, man, whew, that's a problem. But then, yeah, it's smelling like gas and we're probably getting high. We're gonna push the button. Oh. Jesus Christ. Okay, um, um, it might be on. That was, wow. One second. Are my eyebrows still? Jesus Christ, don't do that. Don't blow shit up. Oh my God. We are still alive. Holy shit balls. Um, we're gonna close that. That's not what happened the last time I did it, okay? Anyways, um, what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna just show you. There's a little um, uh, thermometer. I am having a panic attack. Um, we're gonna let that kind of get cranked up. We're getting it all warm and juicy in there. And then we're gonna put some um, hot dogs and hamburgers. There is like ash on my face. Oh my God. Like it poofed. Oh guys, this was the wrong move. Holy hell. So I assume this is normal. Um, I don't actually know. Um, we're gonna open her up and hope it doesn't explode. Yeah, yeah, we're just, this is what grilling is, guys. It's just smoking. <coughs> uh, went right into my lungs. Okay. <coughs> so we're gonna, we're actually, we're gonna close it back up. I don't know if that's good or not, but, oh man, I am not about to ask my husband because I am not a little bitch. So this is dinner, just getting it hot, 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 and then <coughs> throw some meat on there. Is this helpful to you? I'm still like not sure if my eyebrows and my eyelashes are attached. We're cooking, you know? This is how you do it. Don't let a man like tell you you can't do this, cause, oh, cause you can. Um, we're like a family of six, but like clearly Nobody cares to eat when mom's cooking. So there's a hamburger and some lovely, and I'm gonna put them like on an angle because I think that's gonna give them like a really nice grill line, which in, is my understanding is that's like what it takes to like be a grill expert. Is like make your limes look good. Yeah, we'll check back in a second when we're looking at our meat. That's what we're here for. Looking at meat, just hanging out. Two ladies just having a meat party. We have reached an optimal 
it. <laughs> Get out of here. Temperature of 400 degrees. I assume that's good for a hot dog, which is basically just rolled up baloney. Um, no one's getting botulism on my watch, let me tell you. We're just cruising along. And I'm just <laughs> gonna rotate my little my little doggies a little bit. But those, look at those, oh yeah. Beautiful grill marks. Just juicy, fantastic. Oh yeah. Look at that beauty. We're not done yet, folks. We'll be flipping her some more. Okay, okay. Stay where you are. Stay where you are. I just want you guys to know that like I am busting out my best cinematography for you right now. Um, all the angles, all the stunts and death-defying activities. This is not acting, okay? This is real life. Um, I really and truly have to feed my family. If you guys would like to watch me cook, um, more complicated foods. Just let me know in the comments. You don't know how to use your barbecue? You're afraid you're gonna blow yourself up? Let me try, let me do it for you. Like, don't kill yourself. That's why I'm here. Ah! Game changer. Okay, let's check on our food. And, oh yeah, those dogs are looking perfect. Look at that, oh, just a little bit of crispiness all over. Ooh la la. Yeah, but those grill lines, whew. There is our juicy little burger. I'm gonna just, pull, oh, I'm gonna flip her just to look at the other side. Ooh, look at that. Look at that cross hatching. Whoa, delightful. Um, come on, you. Get over here. Um, done. And then I'm gonna turn these dials back to off. Last but not least, I am turning off the gas. So when my husband comes out to see what I've done, I've mostly not ruined anything. Thank you for being here with me in uh, life's worst moments. It has just been my pleasure to just teach you how to use the barbecue <laughs> so that you don't have to talk to your husband. This has been Jossie Potts saying, don't set yourselves on fire. Love you all.